Hello everyone, I'm Pacific the Casual Gamer. Welcome back to another video, and in this video, we're going to talk about my opinions on how well Oblivion does alchemy. Now, alchemy in video games can take form in many different ways, right? You have the alchemy of Oblivion, where you combine two things and then pop comes out a potion. Um, and then you have all the way up to, I guess, Kingdom Come Deliverance, where you're at an alchemy station... And you have to do everything step by step. And if you mess up one thing, you're screwed and you just have a mystery potion. So, Oblivion, the alchemy system, in case you don't know, is you have your ingredients. And they have four effects. But you can only use one effect until you start leveling up. Then you level up alchemy, it becomes two effect, three effect. And then eventually you can use all four effects. And you can combine them. So, for instance, if you have a Restore Fatigue and a Restore Health, and another ingredient has Restore Fatigue and Restore Health, then you make a Restore Fatigue and Restore Health potion. Very simple like that. Now, there's a couple of things with this system that I really like. And that is that when you make potions, you genuinely feel like you're being able to make better potions. Because as you level up, not only do you find better potion making gear, but your potions, just as you level up, feel more potent they feel stronger right like in the beginning usually you make a restore health potion it's like two points for seven seconds and then you make another one it's like 10 for seven seconds you know at the end of the game so i like that you can upgrade your equipment and i like that as you level up your potions become more potent now there are some problems with this system that i think um take away from the potion making experience and there's kind of like three things i think so the first one is the alchemy gear I think that the alchemy gear could be done a little bit better. I think that to use like an apprentice or a journeyman type gear, you should be at least that level to be able to use that type of gear, right? And another thing is I think that if you're making potions, you should have kind of a system where you sh where you could pick not only the effects you want, because sometimes you can make a really good restore health potion, but at the cost of, like, drain willpower, right? Something random like that happens. And so I think um, you should be able to pick your options that you have, you know, your things. And maybe even if there's ways to increase potency, because I know that if you make a restore fatigue potion and you add more ingredients that restore fatigue, it doesn't actually increase the effect. So I think that the more, like if you have four restore health ingredients, that should be a more powerful potion than just two ingredients, right? And that's really my problem. And I actually like Skyrim's, this is just a side note, I like Skyrim's system where you have to taste the ingredients to figure out what it does first. I wish you would have to do that in Oblivion. Just saying. That's my other, like, the third thing that's way out there is that you should be able to taste ingredients. And I, it doesn't seem like the potency of potions is controllable. It doesn't seem like you can actually control the potency of the potions. I mean, yeah, you can level up, but that's a permanent increase to the potency. I don't know why you'd want a decrease, but... Who knows? You know, I, I kind of... I can see with paralyzes, because actually paralyzes... Um, when you make a paralyzed po poison, like, one second of paralyze is basically the same as two. So, why not just have two one-second paralyzes instead of one two-second one, if you know what I mean. Like, little things like that. Alright, maybe you, maybe you can make such a strong restore health potion that you don't even need one, right? So little things where potency might matter later on in the game, later on in the meta. And I think it'd just be a little cool thing. But I would like to know your thoughts of potion making in the comments below. Do you like it in Oblivion? Do you not? I mean, I like it better than Skyrim, because Skyrim you have to go to an alchemy bench. And I, it just seems awkward to me. But that's it, guys. I'm Pacific the Casual Gamer. If you enjoyed, you can tell me in the comments below. Subscribe if you're new for more Oblivion videos. I'm Pacific the Casual Gamer. I suck just as bad as you do at video games. And I'll see you in the next episode, stream, or vlog of whatever I decide to make.